we've got a strong and sound economy. What a contrast it would be if we listened to the right honourable gentleman. And because I regularly subscribe to the Islington Tribune, I can announce to the House his latest economic adviser, one Mr Yanis Varoufakis. He was... He was the Greek finance minister who left his economy in ruins. That is Labour's policy in two words. Acropolis now. (laughs) The Prime Minister, Mr Speaker, seems to be in a bit of denial here. (laughs) Ofsted and the the National Audit Office all confirm there is a shortage and a crisis of teachers. Ensuring there are enough excellent teachers in our schools is obviously fundamental to the life chances of children. When 70% of head teachers warned they're now having to use agency staff to staff their classrooms, isn't it time the government intervened and looked at the real cost of this, which is damage to children's education, but also £1.3 billion spent last year on agency teachers? We had this agency working situation in the National Health Service and also in education. Aren't we moving into an era which we can term Agency Britain? I think he's got to look at the facts rather than talk down people who are working so hard to teach children in our schools. And the facts are these. Our teachers are better qualified than ever. A record 96.6% of teachers in state-funded schools now have a degree or higher qualification. Those are the facts.